Coach always talks about playing fast, practicing fast. It's looked all spring like it's a faster pace. How much of that is just because you're familiar with the system and you know what they want from you this year? Uh, that definitely, that's definitely played a big part. Um, second year in the system, you know, there we didn't have to learn the, the whole playbook all over again. It was basically the same, some of the same plays from last uh, season and last spring. So, you know, being year two into the offense, we didn't have to relearn everything. So we were able to take that into stride and then coach started throwing in some more things. Um, I'm pretty sure he told y'all that, you know, he, he's barely halfway into his playbook. So, you know, we're, he's throwing more, like a little thing here, a little thing there. And you know it's making us go faster. And his whole thing is, you know, getting on the getting on the quarterback so they don't snap the ball um, before the referee gets set. So uh, we've been going fast, and that's his big thing is just going fast and fast and fast. And the faster we go, the happier he is. So you know, he gets upset, he starts pulling quarterbacks out, and we're going slow. So um, you know, year two into the system, I really think that's that's helping. You know, we got a lot of people who have been in the system for you know, like I said, two years. They know what's expected. They know the plays that are expected, and you know, they they know what. Coach more expectations are, and, and that's make, making us go faster. First play of the game is another uh, deep shot to you. Did you ask for that coming into this? I did, I did not ask for it. I mean, I told Coach I want to you know, make as many plays as I possibly can. I know there are going to be a lot of people out here who want to see some exciting things, so I was trying to, you know, my my thing is I want to go out there and do the do whatever I can for the team, but give a good show for the crowd as well, as well, because our fans are the, are the most important part of our team, so you know, I, you know, I just want to go out there and, you know, just play, play ball and have fun, so I didn't ask for it. Um, there was a honorary coach who who he his biggest thing was he wanted to go deep the first play so he did and I mean I had to make go make a play um, there's a kid right behind me Alex Honey I'm um, pretty sure y'all saw him big 6'5 kid big frame kid and I'm working with him right now trying to get his um, fundamentals right uh, that's that's like his, his his thing that he struggles with the most right now is his fundamentals um, so me and him are both working with each other pushing each other to get our fundamentals right uh, James Proche, um he sat out last year he's a red shirt um, that kid can fly he can make plays you know if, if he has if he's one-on-one in space somebody's gonna make a miss um, he's a warrior um, he balls um, Myra Gilliard he didn't play today um, but he's been getting better every day in spring um, helping Shelby Walker who's, who's at five man also in the slot um, they're pushing each other every day to get better um, I think him sitting out last year was a, was really important him Alex and James all sitting out last year was really important for them to develop their body uh, learn the system more so like we said they can go faster once the spring rolls around and once fall camp rolls around we can go faster and um, there's no, no no hitch no hesitation once the season rolls around Oh, definitely. Um, you know, we got Matt, Ben, and Daryl right now, and all three of them. You know, I, I, I don't have a preference on who throws who, who throws the ball to me, who throws the ball to any of our receivers, because they all do a very good job of reading the field and getting the ball to the open receiver. And that's that's one thing that we like as receivers. You know, we don't like to be put in bad situations. Um, you know, with, with a chance of us getting our head taken off because of a bad read or like that. So we don't ever have to worry about that with our quarterbacks right now. They're all doing an excellent job of you know making sure that, that we're able to make plays for the team. From a receiver standpoint, do you even notice a difference between them in terms of their cadence, the way they call the play, the way the ball comes out of their hand? Is um, there a big difference from your perspective? I, I think there's a difference. Um, Matt, Matt, with Matt, you got to be more alert of, of where he could be because you know he might you might look back he's in the pocket and you look back again and he's out the pocket he's and he's rolling to the left you got to you know, go make a detour um with Ben Ben's gonna sit right there in the pocket and if he if if, there, if the windows if he thinks that he can get the ball in the window he's gonna throw it so he throws rockets and you got to be ready for it and you can even see it on routes on there a lot of our receivers were at the beginning of the of spring were having a, a hard time of you know catching it clean there were a lot of double catches when Ben throwing the ball and with Daryl Daryl has a, a he, he's a shorter shorter quarterback but he has a really really strong arm he's a shorter quarterback and he also ropes it. So a lot of curl balls, a lot of um, routes. We have to go back to the quarterback. You have to be ready to you know, get your hands right and catch it clean with Darrell. One of the guys you go against in practice, Jordan Wyatt, moved from safety to corner. From your perspective, going against him, how's he doing in that transition? I, th I think you know when we first came in, he was already a corner, so he that's that's um, you know familiar ground for him. So him going to safety, coming back wasn't wasn't too bad of a wasn't too big of a change for him because he's used to the corner position. I honestly like going against him because he has NFL speed. He runs a, a good four three, so it's, you know I'm able to run by a, a run by a few of the other corners on our team and corners in, in our in our. Um, 
circumference. And then, you know, so going against him, having good 4-3 speed, and he has really good hands, really strong. That's one thing a lot of people don't know about him. He doesn't look strong, but he's really strong. And, um, you know, he gives me a really good look every time I go against him. So, you know, anytime we're lined up one-on-ones or, or doing 7-on-7 seven seven or uh, good on good, you know, me and him are making sure we're going against each other to make sure that we're, we're, no, we're making each other better. So, I, I honestly like going against him. You know, the transition, I don't think it made a, it was a big change for him because it's familiar ground to him. But I think that he, he does, he's doing a really good job at the position that he is right now.